All products bought in this video were from Chaos Cards, which you can check out at chaoscards.co.uk, and they sell all sorts of board games, role-playing games, dice games, miniature games, and trading card games, and some like not so well-known trading card games like My Little Pony, Power Rangers, or well, the loads more, and also accessories for those games like. Uh, deck sleeves, play mats, binders, etc. Ruth here with the Blastoise EX Red and Blue Collection Box. I've had to put my camera up higher so it would fit the entire box on the screen. So, that's the box. That is the side of the box. That's another side. That's the top. This side is the same as the other one, and the reverse is that. So basically it says the same thing as the uh, Charizard one, it just changes the blue, change the red to blue, and changes the word Charizard for Blastoise, so yeah, yep. And that's the Blastoise. And another Charizard was, you get what I'm saying. It's coming kind of with the regular size promo. Jumbo promo and four card pack, four generation packs. So let's get this open. Can I get this open without damaging too much of anything? Ha! Oh. Also comes with the code card, but that's kind of obvious. So I shall cut that up later. Right. So There we have it. So we have a the Blastoise as the main picture. In the background is Gyarados and Vaporeon. Though if I'm going to guess, which I found a slight uh, pattern, is that the Charizard one had a Flareon. So the next one is Venusaur, so it might have a Leafeon in that one, is my guess. And a Jolteon in the Pikachu EX box. So, it'd be quite funny if I actually am right. But yeah. So that is the X. So I should put that to the side. Code card goes over there. Haven't actually sold any of them yet, I just kept them so far. I'll get around to putting them on eBay, I think, maybe. I'll just wait for a bit. Oh, well, I missed that one. Alright. So here is the Jumbo. Oh yes, I never did say, did I? Yeah. It's the, uh... X Y one two two Black Star promo. I don't know why in some places they've got this Jumbo card, when in other places they've got a little mini figurine. Be nice if they just made up their mind to one or the other instead of two types. Anyway, so I shall put that in the back. And if I have any room in the back. So as I've seen other people do, I think I'll leave this... Hmm. Should I leave the Blastoise for last? Am I right in saying that the thicker they are, the most likely I'll have something in it? 
If so, this is really, really thin. Anyway, okay then. Well, these two last. This way. So Blastoise first. Card trick. And we got a Charm Charmander. Clement. Team Flare Grunt. Geodude. Dark Energy. Krabby. Caterpie. Energy Switch. Reverse Hollow. Let me just put these up a bit. There, so it won't fall down then. It's a nice reverse all of that though. And a Dancy for the Radiant Collection Hollow. Though I think I have one already. Anyway. And a Jinx. Regular rare non hollow. Venusaur next. We've got a Swablu, Metapod, another Clement, another Dark Energy, Slowpoke, Paras, Scatterpea, Persian, Reverse Hollow. The Radiant Collection is another Slurpuff, which I have at least two of these, so this one will definitely be being sold. And awesome! Fantastic! A Meowstic EX. I don't have very many EXs, but <clears throat> this looks cool. Just look at his little little mouth, the nose there. It does look like he has bat ears. <laughs> anyway, so it's got the ability of a shadow ear. It looks like his ears are huge. Anyway. Once during your turn, before your attack, if this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, you may move one damage counter from one of your Pokemon to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Now that is a good ability. Then there's Mind Shock, which is 60 damage, and not affected by a weakness or resistance, which is awesome. So that, yay! It's been ages since I actually had a... Yes. <clears throat> Please be another one. Otherwise I am totally unlucky. Flabebe. Pokeball, which is definitely being sold. I have that red card too. Grass energy. Diglett. Things are falling down. And a Paris to go with it. A Pikachu, a Reverse Cloister, which is pretty cool, it's a little cheesy smirk there. And awesome, finally! I was waiting for this one. Since I had the Charmander and Charmeleon, I actually didn't get the English version of this yet, so that's awesome! And, ooh, Icy Color, and... Oh, yes! Woohoo! Jolteon EX. Just look at his little paws. I mean, <laughs> with Swift for 30 damage and Flash Ray for 70 damage with 160 HP. Though technically Jolteon's not my favorite, but it's still an Eevee evolution, so <laughs> no one can complain with that. And also, if anyone's have ever said, the Jolteon kind of resembles the uh, Thunder card off Card Captor's Sakura. Or Sakura, depending on how you want to say it. Anyway. Sweet. Yay! So far, two EXs. Or three if you count the promo. So Charizard's left. Is this going to be good? Will we get three 
packs in a row that contain EX cards and I missed the trash can. Right. Oh, I think I just saw a bit of color there. Right. Flavebebe, again. Team Flaregrunt. Mr. Mime. Rhyhorn. Uh, Psychic Poison. What? That's a purple one. I forgot. Poison. Or is it Psychic? Anyway, it's one of those. Or just the purple eye. Diglett. Another Pikachu. And a Reverse Haunter with a Radiant Collection of another Charizard. <laughs> it's two. <laughs> two for two there. Since the last one was a Charizard. Anyway, good. All good. And for the next card is awesome! <clears throat> Venusaur EX. That would have been quite something if I actually got the Blastoise or Blastoise EX card. But, or Mega Blastoise, you know what I mean. But here is the Venusaur EX. One of the three starter trio. It would be funny if I got this again in a Venusaur box, but hopefully I could get a Blastoise in a Venusaur box. That would just, that'd just be funny. But anyway, awesome. Totally like with Frog Hop, which is just weird. Flip coin heads. This attack does 40 more damage. And Poison Impact. Opponent's active Pokemon is now asleep and poisoned, which is doubly good for 80 damage. 180 HP. And so shiny and sparkly too. Sort of. It's more of the shine that sparkles on the other bits. So it doesn't actually have sparkles on it. Unlike the Japanese Pokecune that has mega sparkles. You can look at my previous video if you want to see the sparkliest cards you'll ever see. But anyway, so the awesome EX cards. I never understood how they how the rarity goes exactly. So this must be ultra rare or something. Anyway, so those. Then we got the Radiant Collection. Shininess. Then the Reverse Hollow Shiny. Anyway, so this is just... Yeah. Though it would be fun if I actually got the Charizard. Bulbasaur and Venusaur as a thing, but yeah, that didn't happen. Oh well. So yes, yeah, so this is it for <coughs> the box. So look forward to the next box, which is um, Venusaur EX box, which, if I look at my list of what I pre-ordered, comes out on the 16th of July. So which is good. So that's like three days before my birthday. So hopefully I'll arrive on my birthday or something. So that'd be cool. So the next for the June one is Manaphy. And there is no a red and blue collection coming out then. Alright, so, the next, Venusaur EX, 16th of July, Pikachu EX, 16th of September, which I guess would be around after the Generations Elite Trainer Box that comes out at supposedly the 15th of September. Hopefully, it'll be on pre-order soon so I can pre-order that. It'd be great. So. So there is also an Eevee binder, an Eevee playmat, with the Eevee evolutions and silhouettes in the background. 
which I am definitely getting. Though, I probably should have a Pokemon playmat, you know, to do these things with it. Though the EV binder uh, comes out near my birthday in July sometime. I think it was the 15th, maybe? And the EV playmat comes out on the 15th of August. So, anyway. <clears throat> I am rambling on. So, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. Over and out.